White flag when they come back. And take a look at this battle back here for the bubble as we get down to the end of this one. There's the bubble. There's Derek Cope in that number 36 trying to hang on to this thing. White flag is out. One lap to go. Cope fighting off Brett Bodine in the 11. Meanwhile, the leaders go down into turn number one. Last time around, and you've got Jared in front, Skinner in second, Irvin is in third, Jimmy Spencer in fourth, Sterling Marlin right there, but not close enough. The battle is among the top three. Jared, Skinner, the new name to be reckoned with, and Ernie Irvin. You can see Dale move down low on the racetrack to get that inside line going into turn three. Mike Skinner is fighting very hard to close in. That looks like Jared has the stuff today, though. The Spencer is closing back up again on Ernie Urban as they round three and head for turn four. Down the stretch for the final time in this first 50 lapper. As they come to the strike, it's going to be Dale Jarrett showing his muscle with Mike Skinner in second spot. And the battle for the bubble coming to the line. It's going to be that number 36 right there and the 11 right behind him. Give it to Derek Hope in 15. Happy folks down on pit road that you know pretty well. Well, Todd Parrott and that entire crew, Steve Allen, and all of them, uh, they really worked hard on that car this week. Look out, Daytona 500 Sunday. Can he win it three times? Well, Dale Jarrett certainly looks stout here in this first 125-mile qualifier. Let's take a look at how Dale Jarrett took the lead from his teammate. Ernie Irvin was leading coming off of turn four, Ken, and whether his car slipped a little bit, Jarrett got a good run. Look how close they got together, but then Mike Skinner came along behind Jarrett and just gave him the push that he needed right on into the lead. From Jarrett's in car. Okay, you can see Ernie Irvin coming off turn four. The car is pushing right here. You can see him trying to get it. He checks up just a little bit. Jarrett drives to the inside. Just a little contact there, not anything intentional. He goes right by and takes the lead. At 190 miles per hour. And the finish. This is how they came to the line. Of course, uh, Jared kept it down on the inside coming through turn four and dipped right down to the inside to get the checkered flag. Mike Skinner up on the outside and another look at that. Super slow-mo as they come to the strike. There's the 88 across. Second spot, oh, way back for Daytona. He had to be a car length between first That's and second. That's slow motion, pal. That's quicker than you can wink your eye. <laughs> Let's go to victory lane. 